this is Faith. And um, Faith Ann Sienkiewicz, and ironically her, <laughs> you'll always remember that her initials are F-A-S, totally ironic, um, coincidental. Um, she was born with the full-blown FAS and had a very rough start, was possibly predicted not to live and um, was in the hospital for three weeks. When she came to us at nine weeks, she was still going through withdrawals and things like that and she, she has overcome such odds and I really believe that a big part of that is, is um, the early intervention. We put her into all different forms of exercise and gymnastics and basketball and as soon as she could walk we just kept going and she's in gymnastics and she does very well with that and um, she's really taken to the piano and I'm surprised by that. I'm amazed at some of the abilities that she has and music is definitely one of them. It's amazing what she is capable of doing with um, having f the full-blown fetal alcohol syndrome and yet she definitely um, you know, has so many gifts and um, um, we were told to expect that her IQ would be in the 70s and it's in the 90s, which we're very thankful for. Every, everywhere she goes, um, she brings a smile to people's face. She makes us every day realize what's really important in life and she may never be the straight A student or the valedictorian of her senior class or anything like that, but um, the little things, her smile, um, she definitely has gifts to offer. And, um, and sometimes we wonder, what would her potential have been? Um, we look at the gifts she has, and, and what would her potential have been had, had her birth mother not drank when she was pregnant? She will always most likely need someone to walk along with her through life, and um, we will always be there to help her along the way and um, help her to make the best of her abilities and share, share her gifts, because she's a special little kid.